The Montana Army National Guard is gearing up for Exercise Defender Europe 20 this upcoming summer. It's the largest exercise of U.S. based military forces in Europe in the last two decades. Defender 20 is an opportunity for Montana's Army National Guard soldiers to show how effectively the U.S. can deploy a division sized combat credible force from our soil to Europe in just a short amount of time. Myself and photographer John Riley tagged along on a routine explosives exercise. Here's a look at the firepower these armed soldiers are capable of deploying. So it's always something I wanted to do since I was little. My job as a company commander is to you know, train these soldiers to fight and win the nation's wars. When you're part of the Montana Army National Guard, you train one weekend a month, two weeks out of the year. You know, understandably with the time crunch of being a National Guard soldier, uh, doing this one weekend a month, uh, it's, it, it's very difficult, it's very time constricted. Uh, but we make the best of every single training opportunity we can get. This is one of those opportunities. These soldiers are getting hands-on experience with live explosives. With the AT-4s, it's a disposable rocket launcher. So we have nine rockets, nine people get to shoot them. Um, those are our main anti-tank weapons, so it's very important that we get a lot of training and hands-on experience with those. <laughs> This is just routine training for these Army National Guard soldiers. They've already been through the most dangerous training in the Army, and their commander says they are ready for anything. I am extremely fortunate to be where I am uh, as a company commander and being in charge of you know, 135 soldiers that can accomplish any task that's given to them. The 163rd has a long history of service to Montana in responding to natural disasters and facing America's threats abroad. The unit fought in the Pacific during World War II and Captain Bogdan has served in Iraq during Operation Iraqi Freedom and Operation New Dawn in Afghanistan. I joined the National Guard because I wanted to serve my community. Uh, I felt like this was the best way to also have a life outside of that and be able to do the service that I wanted to do. But members of the National Guard are more than just soldiers. We're always available um, when it comes down to anything of the civil and state missions that come down, uh, flood relief, fires. Yeah, we're always ready. The National Guard has members from all walks of life ready to serve their country at any moment. A third of Captain Bogdan's soldiers are also red card firefighters. And Captain Bogdan and his wife are small business owners.